So sitting around on May 3rd, that's a significant day, a birthday uh, of someone uh, that uh, I always like to celebrate. And uh, all of a sudden, a, a welcome home from Beamer comes through. It was uh, unexpected. And uh, so you start to gather information and feedback. Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? And it ends up being uh, it ended up being told, hey, it's, it's somebody that's flipping uh, from another SEC school uh dig into it a little bit and lo and behold the, the kids flipping from georgia and i was like wow <laughs> this is a pretty good piece of recruiting uh donovan westmoreland from griffin uh is a guy that uh, a lot of people forget about you know he, he's rated as a high three-star prospect for per 24 7 sports composite but 24 7 sports has him as the number 24 linebacker in the country and a 91 which is not the lowest four star you can get uh, he's a guy that can play what, what, kind of the Sam linebacker position. He can come off the edge. I, I think they'll kind of use him all over the place. He, he's really a versatile guy. Uh, I think Georgia really liked the way he could rush the passer, and so did South Carolina. Just one of those things where, you know, sometimes a, a school will take a guy and uh, they can stay committed all they want, but uh, they're not feeling the love, and he ended up feeling the love from South Carolina. Uh, and flipping on May 3rd, and he's stayed committed ever since. So really good defensive player, really good pickup by Mike Peterson, uh, South Carolina's Bucks and ends coach, and Clayton White, the defensive coordinator, uh, who were all over this guy. Jimmy Lindsay, the defensive line coach, too, out of Central Georgia. Donovan Westmoreland signs with South Carolina, uh, former Georgia commit, Georgia player, exactly the type of Peach State prospect you want to sign if you're trying to build near the Gamecocks.